Hey folks, it's Jiren. Welcome back to Let's Play Victoria 2 with Austria-Hungary. And uh, we're still at war with Russia. Decided to push them preemptively, so we knocked them out of their feet before they're ready to fight the war. Because we kind of had an army, and Germany also had an army, and Russia kind of had an army, but you know, they're Russians. So. We thought it would be a wise idea to just blitz them and kill them while leaving Italy border empty. Uh, the Balkans border empty, you know, all our good friends in the Balkans can easily invade us at this point and we will be knocked out of the world. And the Ottoman, not the Ottoman, the Austro-Hungarian Empire as you used to know it will no longer exist. But that's the fun part of the game, I mean, the, the bad part will be that we actually beat off Russia and we become like unstoppable because we acquire all of Russia and that will be really, 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 really fucking awesome. Alright, so we're still pushing. Great. Supply-wise, I believe they may probably still get supply from water. That's my thought here. I don't know. And, uh, unit and poor supply, inefficient research, lack of troops. Yeah, I know there's a lot of lack of troops. That's kind of normal. Uh, what's your objective here? Where are you going? Anyway, go grab that city. Oh, actually, it's it's a uh, parent. Who's AI control? You you are AI controlled. Okay, so you got these uh, objectives already. So we'll leave you at these. Meanwhile, we're still pushing all around. And Russia really seems like an empty empty big shell at this moment, but we're still in August, so. Let's hope the war will be over by uh, before Christmas. That will be pleasant. But right now, we're doing kind of not great. Well, we're pretty slow. And that's mainly the issue going on. But they're just running away. So we're kind of winning. But at the same time, I know Russia. I, I know their strategy. They will just let us gain territory and territory and territory. And, and strike back at the worst moment possible. That's what they usually do. So that's probably what they're going to do right now. And it will crush us in uh, an humiliating defeat. If that happens, though, uh, I don't know. I'll be sad. I will stop influencing Italy. I'll come. I, I sure want to influence Italy. So, how come I cannot influence? Three diplo points are needed. So, okay, get going technology. I don't have diplomatic points anymore. So, let's grab some also grab some officers okay so luck luck down here and luck down here I don't know how many officers I need but I'll find out soon enough all right so you I need to pile up points influence nation yep so I guess it costs three points per day oh one point per day Okay, that's uh, reasonable. Cost three to set up and then one point a day to use it. So that's pretty nice. And we're taking over the land of Russia right now. Pushing to the big, big, big population centers. Hopefully they don't start massing civilians against us. So we can actually conquer something. And Romania demobilized. That's really good and interesting. Thank you, Romania. Uh, taking a good sip of water while crushing Russia. Yeah, that's how you play that game. I guess that's how you play. Oh, I'm, am I losing? Yeah, it kind of good, kind of bad. Actually, Russia, what's your... Your kind of uh, started beating. 15.70% uh, toward giving up. Come on, AI yourself man I think production I will need to prioritize reinforcement it's that so inexpensive okay so I guess we're doing okay uh, seems like we're getting a Russian counterattack
but at the same time we're moving onto Russia main cities here oh here's Kursk bad thing I don't have panzers good thing because austro Hungaria doesn't exist in the second world war so will not be in the right uh, time frame for that let's see maybe maybe I've reached my objectives and I kind of did Oh, you want to go all the way to Moscow? How about you? How about you? How about you? Wait, what? Okay, these guys just want to go there. Yeah, we'll take that. Ah, uh, these guys. What's the objective here? Do they even have an objective? I don't think they do. Well, actually, that's not the one that's uh, AI controlled. That's the one that's AI controlled. And these are the guys from Moscow. All right. Fine. Go for Moscow. How about you? What's your objective? The capital? I guess so. Seems like so. Ooh. We have a nice battle going on here. Nice. I don't know how reinforcement is doing, if it's good or not. We're lacking troops, that's for sure. Uh, we got two takes ahead, so let's just remove them for now. Alright, education. And let's see, we're now in 1913, so, oh, we can't yet develop tanks, it will be next year. Can I actually start it? Will eventually come useful. Uh, these are 1914 techs, so let's grab that. Alright, a lot of troops, a lot of battles. Yeah, we're doing poorly now, Russia isn't backing so much. And we're just in September. Alright, let's grab the main HQ. That's AI control. Defensive state. Oh god damn it. Okay, so now I'm just out of uh, AI control because AI can do the right things. Guess we're holding out here. We got some militia coming up. Let's move them up here. Uh, yeah, there's some uh, big city here. We just captured this one. That's pretty interesting. And why can I go there? Too low infrastructure. But I'm just cavalry, man. That should not even be a problem. You here. Ooh. It's not mobilized. By mobilizing? How come it's not working? Hmm. Okay. Not exactly sure how or what to do. Alright, so we'll move the troops here. We got 30k stack. Yeah. Another battle going on here. Kind of doing fine, but we'll back off. Because right now we want to defend that point, Riga. We want to keep that intact. And let's go grab that big city. And let's go grab that big city. Let's move some reinforcement here. And here we're going to start encircling Kharkov, which will be good. Uh, we got some couple of uh, divisions here, probably some cavalry. We do have some cavalry, so we could be moving forward. You are retreating, that's fine. 
Right, let's take a quick look at the VP map mode. Yeah, we're nearing some important points here. So we want to make sure we're able to push properly, especially here. We need some good push there to grab Minsk, which will be important. Probably important. We got a lot of. Uh, how do I control? Grab all the units. That's probably how. So let's move more support around here so we can go grab here. Hopefully, maybe encircle that army and come back, loop around. But that probably is not realistic. And by probably not realistic, I mean it's not realistic at all. So we'll just push for Minsk and then attempt to maybe come close back over here just so we can crush this uh, little pocket of resistance. And then we'll be able to push to other cities. That makes uh, slightly more sense and appears to me that it will be slightly more coherent. Okay, who's attacking? Stop attacking. Start. Stop moving there. Start attacking there. You're going to start attacking here in support too. We really need to crush that city. Ah, that's a small army. It's not really an army at all. Okay, so just hold there, defend up. Here we're already defending. Okay, we'll be able to push up here. And come on, let's grab Minsk. Here we're just defending, but I guess I can move some, uh, a couple of units. Like these guys, 30k. And we will do a big push on that little city down south. Hopefully capturing it. Here we're still moving toward uh, Rostov Nadon. Not sure if that's how you say it. But that's how I'm going to say it. And that's just like uh, 1,000 guys. Probably has absolutely no competence. Yeah. It's a HQ. Okay, I really don't know if they're good to that. I mean, it seem like just being people working for management and such. You know, research human guys on the battlefield. Let's go and fight. Show the rest of your troops you're not a cord. And this year is a really bad battle going on. We're in low supplies here. Really low supplies. Or is it because we're too far? Let's just bring up Ford. I really have no idea how the supplies exactly work. I know there's a supply map, so let's take a moment and I stir it, and I have no idea. I guess it's just low supply. Yeah, it's just low supply in the area. That's because it's Russia. They're in dire need of mechanization, that's for sure. And we still use a sickle even today, so. That's Russia for you. Alright, so here we got some forces moving up. And we're still going to attack at uh, Minsk. Uh, we're going to hold out Riga. It will be interesting to push up, but uh, let's not overextend yet. Especially in, since we're getting late summer. Well, actually late December now. Alright, so these guys are going to convoy raid. Convoy raiding. Bam. And coastal submarine. That's all too far. Convoy raiding here. Bam. Okay, let's see if we're starting to catch up fishes. Hmm. Let's grab the theater. I kind of see everything going on. I guess I'm too far for the supply. That's probably the issue here. So that guy will be uh, split out. And this guy will disconnect. And we will connect him to Ganvien. 
these guys actually gonna become oh disconnect that let's connect to again Vien so we will move the uh, Viennese v Vien HQ we'll move them up all right these guys all need some support here hmm yeah we'll just hold out the line here for the moment at least what's the uh, weather like pretty 